I dive into frozen ways where the past comes back to life. Hi everyone, welcome back. Today I have a tutorial with the Lorac Unzipped Palette. I recently just got this palette and I showed it in a haul and I said it was a rose gold lover's dream. It is a great palette. It has mattes and shimmer in it, enough to create a full look. Uh, one palette, you can get full look. You can get a smoky look and a daytime look. This really has it all. It has those really nice um, golds and shimmer lid colors, plus it has the uh, matte brow bone color and some really beautiful transition colors. So I love this palette. I'm doing a daytime look with this palette and I'm doing this with as a collab with my friend Rachel from Glow of Grace. Ugh, you guys, I talked in the summer back how I just absolutely love this girl. I think she is stunning gorgeous. She's so sweet. She has like the I don't know, one of the best personalities ever. The way she comes across on camera is the way that she is. I've spoken to her, we've been t texting and talking, and uh, I just absolutely love her. I definitely, I know that you guys will love her. Please go check out her channel. She is doing a look with the Unzip palette. We both kind of got it around the same time, and we thought it would be fun to do a collab together. So I'm doing the daytime look, and she's doing more of a nighttime um, date night look. So. Two looks with the Lorac and Zip. I'll leave Rachel's channel and her video in the information box below. Honestly, you guys have to go over, subscribe, tell her I said hello. I know you guys will love her. So, if you guys are interested in seeing how this palette performs, then go ahead and keep watching. Start out by taking Max Paint Pot and Painterly and prime your lids with this. Fight fear for the selfish pain, it was worth it every time. Next, take Lorac Unzipped Palette and go into this color, Unconditional. It's a really great matte blending color. And I'm using all of the Sigma blending, the new Perfect Blend kit in this tutorial. I'll list all those brushes and a discount code below for you. Blend this through your crease. I wish I didn't need Jason. Taking this Sigma Highlight Diffuser brush, Put the color undercover, which is a really nice, almost pinky toned, matte nude color. Put this on your brow bone and in your inner corner. Now I'm going to go in with this pointed crease brush. It's a very interesting brush and I'm going to take this deep burgundy shade and run this through my crease. I'm taking it all the way into the inner corner and to the outer corner, right through the crease. So you're going to take that all the way through the crease. I really love how this brush applies the color, but it also diffuses it out. Take that all over blend brush that we applied the first color with and just blend that out so you don't have any really harsh lines. Now I'm going to take this color Unbelievable on an exact blend brush and apply this all over the lid. This makes that perfect neutral rosy gold everyday look. I love this color. On the other side of that brush, take this color Unreal. It's a little bit lighter of a rosy tone shade. I'm going to apply this to my inner corner and just a little bit up onto the lid. Kind of blend it into that first color. Taking this smudge brush, I'm going to go into the color Unbelievable and Unconditional and just run this slightly under the lash line. We're going for the day look, so we're not going to put too much color there. Now I'm going to go back into that Unbelievable color and put it under even more. Now take this Bedellum Tools brush and I'm taking this color Untamed, which is a really nice, almost sparkly burgundy shade, and I'm putting that on the outer corner. It brings a gorgeous rosy tone to this look. I'm going back into this highlight shade and just touching up where we might have blended away some parts. I absolutely love this Avon liner. It's the perfect shade of like a plummy purple and I'm just applying this to the, the outer half of my under eye. Curl your lashes and now I'm going to tight line with NARS Larger Than Life eyeliner. I love this eyeliner because it seriously does not budge. So I'm just going to tight line my upper lash line and then roughly apply that on my upper lash line all the way 
in the inner corner. You don't have to be too precise with this because we're going to blend it out. On a pencil brush, take this um, unbridled color, the matte burgundy, and really work to blend that liner out. You're going to have to work fast because this liner sets really quickly. Just kind of smoke it out into the outer corner, but stay stay tight to the lash line because you don't want to bring it too much up onto the lid. Now I'm taking my absolute most favorite mascara ever. This is the Le Volume de Chanel mascara. This thing gives incredible volume. Since we didn't go too heavy on the liner, I figured I could really build up the lashes. Still Take this CoverGirl Lip Perfection Lip Liner. This is in the color Splendid. And then I put this Too Faced La Creme Lipstick in Razzle Dazzle Rose on top. I love this color. Now on top of that, for a little extra shine, I put this Plumping Gloss from the Balm in Coco Coconut. All right, everyone, this is the finished look. Um, I went ahead and applied my lip products, and I showed you what I used. Everything else that is on my face will be listed below. Great investment. This runs about $40. I would definitely put it on y'all's Christmas list. It's one of those palettes that I feel like you can get a lot of different looks from. So um, this was just a very simple, everyday look that I've been doing recently. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Don't forget to head over to Rachel's channel, Glow of Grace, and see her date night look with the unzipped palette. I know you guys will love it. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you all in my next video. Mwah.